I am sitting up here. I'm just so happy to be sitting up here. First of all, I'm happy to be alive. Yes, last night was right. awesome. Mm -hmm. We're all hurting that's from right. the Twitch party. Mm -hmm. I'm mm -hmm. up here with Sean and Steve. What's going on, man? The future man, I can't reach you. Feel my <laughs> soul, feel my energy, <laughs> feel my energy. Adult Swim there we Games, go. my home right. right. So everybody always man. says, John, you're like Adult Swim. And I said, you don't even know. You're repping the shirt. Oh, I'm, I'm, I'm repping the shirt. I am Adult Swim. You're I'm like the more plug. branded than us. It's incredible. <laughs> Since I was 19, I've been watching Adult <laughs> Swim. And now you guys are doing games. And you guys mm -hmm. brought a bunch of cool stuff for us. Yeah, and, man. Man. I'm very excited about this. This is like four games. This is a marathon. This is a marathon. We're this doing a, this. You guys are just bringing all the games. Mm -hmm. it's mm -hmm. like, and it's not a Cowboy Bebop game? No. <laughs> <laughs> you guys specialize in weird indie stuff, right? Yeah, like we're, it's it's less about the sort of brand, like, you know, uh, uh, doing... Aqua the, Teen Hunger Force. Right, it's right? less about doing that mm -hmm. and more about, like, finding other indies and doing that. I mean, we've uh, done a few games, you know, like... A few. Pocket Morty's maybe heard of it. Yeah, I don't, I don't know. know. That one's awesome. I don't know. No, that one's really good. <laughs> but, yeah, so, but, yeah, it's really going out and finding really awesome, great stuff. Like, Steve's always, like, looking for I'm the on the internet all the time, basically. Thing. Thing. That's what it is. And then, yeah, just that's what that's what we do. So that's how you find most of your games, just being online, just yeah. searching for that talent, yeah. right? Or so like, yeah. Is there like a subreddit for it? Is that what, what it is? <laughs> subreddit indie games for Adult Swim. Yeah. Yeah, you're like, okay. <laughs> there's like, there's there's like, that's, that's it. That's a great <laughs> you're like the adult there will be one out. There, there will be, be one. one. Yeah. <laughs> good, good, good. So where are we going to right now? All right, let's start. Let's just jump right into these games. I love it. So first up. Headlander. This is a game that we're publishing by Double Fine. Okay. Um, it's uh, the 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 lead on it is Lee Petty, who did like the art for Brutal Legend and everything. Okay. And then also he was the project lead on Stacking, which was one of my favorite. That's the Matryoshka dolls yeah, one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, that he he was the project lead on that and. That's one of my favorite all-time Double Fine games, and it's like I'm so, so a lot stoked of to see this. for that game. A lot of people love that game, but it's I never so played good. it, man. Oh, dude, you should totally is play it. Is like it's not so your good. friends, but with like little babushka dolls? Is that what it is? Matryoshka, yeah. So they, uh, you, you can change characters by jumping inside bigger oh. uh, Matryoshka dolls, and okay. then you know moving around solving puzzles. Button. It's really awesome. Um, and then this one is, I, I, I was joking with Lee, who thought it was really funny that like he, he has a tendency to make games where you. Uh, you're one part of a thing and that you just change your identity by switching Whoa. bodies. So <laughs> there you go. is that what's going on here? So Headlander That was really cool. <laughs> so Headlander the sort of like the idea behind this game is you are the last human and all you are is, is your head. head. And what? you wake up in the future. I you're like the, the sound of that. Human, that sounds ahead. pretty awesome. You wake up in the future. Future man knows Hello. about the future. I mean, that's all it's in space. Yeah. This I'm is beyond this. your okay. future. This is beyond me, yeah. No, wow. wow. Dang. So I'm so gonna just float in heads. <laughs> I wanted to see how realistic this was to you for spe I mean, specific, specifically. This is blowing my mind. <laughs> so yeah, so um, you're this head and uh, you wake up in the future kind of disoriented and uh, your helmet has a rocket in it. So you can fly around just as a helmet, just as a head and uh, land on other bodies uh, and sort of take them over. And different bodies have different powers. Um, and then there's laser puzzles. Okay. Yo, this <laughs> game up? is a lot prettier than when I saw it before. Yeah. Like, you guys have done a lot to it. Yeah, Double Fine has been, cr like, crushing it. Um, one of my favorite parts is, so it has this really 60s, 70s sci-fi aesthetic. So, it, you know, it looks like... Barbarella or Zardoz and these sorts of gay like uh, movies. Barbarella. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Barbarella. <laughs> going to take it back. Well, take it yeah, real take far it back. back. It's like really far back. 60s, 70s yeah. sci-fi with these sort of like ridiculous like versions of the future. Yeah, there yeah, yeah. yeah. So it has that sort of idea. So um, and um, Lee has been. I guess they they do every week watch a new uh, movie um, from that time. The whole team has to watch it so they can sort of. Oh, so they can capture the aesthetic of it. Okay. Live in the aesthetic. Um, Spaceships that look like dicks. Um, yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yes, sir. Probably an accident. Um, <laughs> so yeah, but that's it. so you solve these puzzles. There's these other robots, as you see, these guards, um, and generally what you want to do is uh, shoot their heads off, make the heads explode, so you can go in and take over their body. Steve hasn't got to the point just yet where he's going to get a new power uh, when he goes through that door. Um, which will allow him... Oh, no, it's a little bit later in this demo, but we're... Uh, you'll see. 
Dude, I don't I'm just watching it. I'm just taking like it there's like kind of <laughs> unique puzzles within the level. Yeah. You know, with the head flying around. Like, yes. Yeah, look at this. So you get these doors uh, named Rude, and they're actually kind of jerks. Like the doors themselves have personalities oh. and, um, <laughs> and uh, won't let you through because you, you know, you, you don't have the right thing going on. So yeah. um, there's a lot of that. Uh, it's very, very funny. There's a lot of little jokes to be found in the environment and stuff, uh, as to be expected from you know, those guys. Yeah, they're not. It's, they're not taking it too seriously. It's a fun game, right. you know. And so, like it's, along the way, we're laughing, right? It is, yeah. and it's just. But it is. It's so beautiful to look yeah. at. It is uh, really. I'm just staring at it, man. You guys have done like <laughs> they've, they've uh, double finds has taken it. They mm -hmm. are. Yeah, they're really on top of it. And this team is Do you so have head good. Head fuel? How does? Is there like head fuel for the head flying around? In the future, oh, right? Yeah. Fuel is a. Con you, it's, it's. It's. You have infinite. all the fuel you want. It's infinite. Awesome, man. Strict. Finally got that whole that's thing right. down. Yeah. He knew. He knew. He knew. Confirmed. Oh, that's wow. old technology, the future man. <laughs> that's right. But they still have carpets and stuff in this future. Yep. So they still have the 70s, so what's old is new again. That's right. I mean, Shag oh, is always going to come back. It's always going to come back. If it's not in, it's going to come back at some point. So are they still listening to, like, Steppenwolf? in the future it's and all the so is that classical rock it's a, is I that like mozart to them it's uh yeah it's sort of like a little bit of that and a little bit of they really like um uh, uh tangerine dream tangerine probably dream. is probably the, the really big it. yeah the soundtrack um, from, yeah, from <laughs> legend of course i was gonna say oingo boingo but that's a that's oingo another boingo, that's, a, no, no, that's another that's, that's 80s that's though no, okay um, Probably Bowie. I would imagine. How do you not listen to Bowie? Of course. Um, Skinnered man oh it'd be some skin <laughs> Uh, but yeah, so there's like all these, you know, it's the, the, there's a, right now, uh, we can't really hear too on? much. Oh, oh gosh. Oh, man. What happened, Steve? I tried Steve. to suck his head off. And yeah. What? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> There you that's go. Game. That's now the game. Just that's game talk, now it's right. stream. That's, that's talk, the official, right that's the official language so, uh, for the game. <laughs> that's right. That's that's that, that, that. But yeah, so he just got the vacuum power, which allows him, as he said, to suck off another person's head. Uh, robot's go. head. Yeah, that's another. right. <laughs> and then land there. Again, that's uh -oh. official game language. That is. That is. That's official game language. Okay. <laughs> this is, it's a, we're not going to get an AO rating. Uh, <laughs> you mean like AO? AO rating. AO rating. <laughs> so yeah, then you get some of these rooms where there, there's guards everywhere. They're all firing lasers at you. And the cool thing is, if sometimes you know if your body explodes, you can fly off with your helmet, and then you're not like dead right away. Uh, you know, if they shoot your helmet, then you know you're gonna start over in the le uh, in that part of the level. So it but gives you an extra chance. You, know, yeah, you yeah. want to keep your body so you can right. shoot your lasers. Oh, oh, Steve again. But then different bodies do different things. So okay. um, Steve was like earlier, he punched a robot because this body punches that first robot uh, body that you're in at the very beginning of the level that one if you press the punch button you don't punch you dance um, I saw that. Wait, I saw that. Dance? It's a dancing robot. There's a, um, There's a, 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 a jive robot. If it's not a combat robot, it has a dance move, basically. So uh, there's like a uh, there's like a horse robot. You can take over a uh, dog, a robo dog, in like later levels. Uh, Is there a hamster? Sure. Game's not done yet. We could. Could <laughs> yeah, be. Thought of that, John, man. If there yeah. is, I haven't got to the hamster level yet. It'd just yet. be like a little tiny <laughs> body <laughs> and a giant just head running around. This just doesn't seem possible. It's not conceivable. It's the future, though, That's man. right. How, so this That's other right. stuff is possible, but the hamster body is The hamster's just crazy. That's Come good. on. Okay, what about an iguana? <laughs> Definitely. Okay. okay. Uh, <laughs> He's like, yes. That's what makes it. Uh, it's <laughs> only iguana body. More okay. Komodo dragon style. But yeah, yeah, yeah. So there's all sorts of different things you can land on. Steve, once he gets past this level, I might not. He gets this is a tough part. Part. Give, give, give me three more days. Give me the future, man. Let's see if he can do uh, it. I'm gonna try it. Try. I, I love right. seeing Let's him. See what He's so good okay. at games. He can just pick it up and right, try. He is punch. Okay. How do we? How do we right, shoot? Right trigger is to shoot. But you right need trigger? to aim with yep. the oh, right. Okay. But you're gonna need to aim with the right stick. Can I duck? Um, I or jump. B is roll. Yeah, he's just beasting it, man. This is. Yep, he just blew up. There we go. Oh, yeah, but so here's a head. Another body. So right bumper is to vacuum the head. <laughs> Just rolling around. And left it. bumper is say. to to attach to a body. There, there we go. go. There you oh, go. Dang. Right. What are you? those egg things in the future? Does that just make sense in the architecture of a spaceship? I mean, it was the 70s. You've seen those chairs. <laughs> those like so living room chairs. It's just like an the egg 7, that you sit in. 70s. That's, that's what this. <laughs> that's what this is. <laughs> that's right. Whoa. Oh, look at that. You went backwards. Or did you go into another room? This is another room. Oh, you made it. You made it to the next room. So left, now, here's left bumper. Yes. Yeah. So you're gonna want to suck off that other head. That's just that blue <laughs> thing that has the antenna, like right the, the beanie on top of it. All right. Uh, right the propeller. Right bumper, propeller right trigger. Um, <laughs> and then you're gonna want to land in that because then now you can take control of this uh, so this computer. Bumper. Oh, yeah. There you Whoa. Go. 
Okay. Um, and then uh, A to deactivate the ship's power systems. So you That's are solid. Me. All right. You are solid right now. Um, now we deactivate, and then we're, then we're go, ready to get uh, back over here. Yeah, you should go keep going to the left. Now and, uh, so this room I love. So these are, I'll, I'll actually give you the hint here instead of uh, <laughs> making you play through this exact part. Yeah. You're talking to these little vacuum bots, and they are like, they can't wait to clean. But you can suck their heads off, too, and then you can become <laughs> a vacuum cleaner. That's awesome. Um, the vacuum cleaner's punch move is a heart <coughs> of gas. You blow Oof. dust out the back of Oof. it, and then other robots don't like the smell. <laughs> um, but now you can drive around on that okay, little, these little vacuum, dude. <laughs> wow. um, and this is actually one of the ways that you solve a puzzle here uh, in this next room yeah. is they're not going to screw with you because you're a vacuum cleaner. You're just, a, you're, just you're meant to they're, be here. They're like, and then you can go through the secret right vacuum port. But if you go in here and you're a vacuum cleaner, other vacuum cleaners will treat you like you're a vacuum cleaner, like you're one of them. Yeah. So it goes less about... Um, uh, how excited they are to clean the ship, and more about the revolution. So right here, he's like wow. trying to destroy the central suction machine that's giving, taking away all of their jobs. Uh, and so there's a little backstory here. Tiny back <laughs> story <laughs> about the revolution about of vacuum cleaners. Vacuums. That's the thing. Like Lee's oh, team, Lee and his team, amazing. Lee and his team. This is what they do. Is like they create all these little, wow. like tiny little nuggets oh of narrative gosh. and story, and, and they're so talented. That's and so, so crazy. Good at this. Yeah, that's yeah. so crazy. Can you be that's like fun. a like?